let me show you how we can blur only part of an image. So here I am in Affinity version 3 by Canva. Be sure you are in the Pixel Studio. So here at the very top, be sure that the one with the violet color is active. We're going to pick a tool from the panel on the left. The tool is called Filter Brush Tool. Click on that and then select the proper filter. In our case, we plan to blur the image, so I'm sticking with the Gaussian Blur. I can modify the size of the brush using the slider, but I can also just press brackets on my keyboard. I recommend to keep hardness to 50%. This way, we can now zoom in, head to the area of the image you plan to blur, change the size of your brush to match that area. In my case, I'm going to blur out the license plate. And then just start brushing. Here it is. We can now double tap on the Gaussian Blur in the layer panel to get this slider that can help us to make this a bit weaker or even stronger blur. I think something like this will do. We cannot read the plate. Okay, so that's an one example. We can censor certain information, private data. Other use is to blur a backdrop or blur a person out of the group picture. Maybe this person don't want to be sure on some kind of Facebook group or some kind of social media scenario. In that case, remember, select the layer, pick the tool. This tool is called a filter brush. Be sure the correct filter is selected. In our case, that's blur. And then we can modify the size of the brush and we can start brushing. In this case, I feel like the blur is not strong enough, so I click in the layer panel, make it a bit stronger. All right, and this way we kind of blur out the person face, but the picture is still usable. All right, I hope this short tutorial about partial blur in Affinity version 3 was helpful. See you in the next one.